Store at kung ano rin po yung mga baryo na dito sa Ilocos North yung kasama sa Tarot um, Festival. Alam ko lahat po ng municipalities kasama ko yung two cities. So talagang magdamagan ito yung festival na to. Talagang and people will stay to wait until malamit yung city yung mobiles. Kasi it's a competition. It's a competition at talagang parang bonggahan pagkita, pagpakita niya. Now, uh, it coincides with the opening of our newly renovated Marco Stadium. So, kung makita ninyo, I don't know if you walk past it. Later po, may meron uh, okay. po. Uh, well, I, I'm sure you're going to see it. So, uh, it's really state of the art uh, area. Talagang maganda, maganda. Very parang pang world class, pang world competition. So, hopefully, uh, it will be a home of many of the different international competition. As to when it started, I believe it started nung um, governor pa po si Makati. Siya po, alam mo naman si Makati, she's very, very artistic and very artistic. She really parang wanted to showcase the different, um, different uh, characters of the different Tapos meron din kasi din kami mga indigenous people that are here at the area of Nebaera. I think sila yata yung current champion in Nebaera. So yun, maganda daw talaga. Everybody, everybody's been looking forward to it. Kasi let's stop nung first they started to rebuild it. So let's stop. Tapos dumating yung pandemic. Wala na talaga. So this is what I mean. Uh, it's really starting again tomorrow. So, I'm going to be I'm going to be the I'm going to be the this is one of the ways to foster camaraderie, to come up with different barangays, and then even the competitive spirit. Because I think that like last month, a fully doing, there were different uh, barangays that competed, and the one that won would represent them to the top. So, so um, maybe we went all out. It's a lot of money. Yes, kasi it was one, but that was one of the things. Pero parang hindi by product na nito. Ang pinaka, ano naman namin, is really to foster the camaraderie among the different municipalities, Right, and, and, and to, uh, to showcase our culture and so, on. So, everybody would know that people started to come. So, yeah. So, now a lot of people really look forward to it. Okay, well, I would like to turn it to one. My question is about. I'm going to be Okay. So it started in November 2011. And uh, it was a way, it's a festival, it's a way for your cars to take pride in history and traditions and faith and culture. It was initiated by Senator Ivy. Uh, the coffee rati. My question is, most Filipino festivals uh, surround a religious celebration. Yes. How would this kind of, because the way most Filipinos, are to So, I'm thinking that 
it's a celebration of the North, Normal East, not really Christian, but it revolves around you. our more tribal, more ancestral yes. memory. Is that an awkward? I think it is like a blending. I said, ask it before with the shepherd, because we the tribal, mm -hmm. and then the religious after everything. So yeah. they call them and they call them. So, Kasi uh, like, diba yung, ano, yung, yung atiatihan is yes. a celebration of the new year. Yeah, yeah. I, 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 Well, uh, here, I mean, uh, because it somehow coincides during the Lenten, Lenten season. Because yeah. like, um, uh, the Lenten giving was one of the resources that we had for Ash Wednesday. But like, a lot of the festivals worldwide are, are, uh, are started during the time of the, the Mardi Gras starts with the Ash Wednesday, the Brazil Carnival um, was also the Ash Wednesday. So it's about that thing. That, Well, uh, dapat, uh, malaman nyo yung last ano is uh, never right? Chapter. They were the previous chapter. So, ngayon, you will have to see who they will, how do we call it, complete themselves for a new competition. So, so a lot of people have said it's also one of the times that we're celebrating every time I know this is when we have celebrations we're celebrating the pensions because it's a few years now I think it's going to be a celebration Um, that the people see, uh, blessing. Yes. 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 Uh, lugar like Ilocos Norte or Ilocos Sur. Well, uh, I guess uh, for now it really is uh, focused with the Cosa Ilocos Norte because they have heritage from at most the ones that would, would be able to uh, join with us would be Ilocos Sur. Because I said, it's not even that it's not even that it's not even that it's not even that we're not even that before. So. Yes. That was the history of the and 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 Morales is about this time of year and uh, start no 2011 onwards it was a bit uh, 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 celebrated yearly so we're going to now um, hopefully like more and more about it so hopefully we look forward to it because uh, everybody enjoyed the, the event.